had to experience in your first year as Chief Justice was the, the argument over whether to change the nonpartisan court plan or not. You were often thrust as the defender of the plan, testifying in hearings, making statements in favor of the plan. Um, was that a role that you were, you were comfortable with? Was it a role that you were expecting to be sort of immersed in this political discussion over how some judges are chosen in this state? Um, well, I'll answer both of those a little bit differently. It, it's, I, I look back, as I'm, Mr. Lee may have done, at my comments um, at a press conference I had two years ago mm -hmm. when I was talking about the issues that I thought I would face. And I was very accurate on, on some of those issues, which was civic education, trying to teach the public more about what our court system is and what it does, um, what the role of the judiciary is and how it's different than the role of the more political branches. And I talked about access to justice issues becoming more and more important, and key among them was the public defender system, which I could see at that time was reaching a crisis situation and we really needed to do something about. Um, and which I talked about in my first state of the judiciary address also um, a year and a half ago, but. But this, it takes um, some time and some background and some research, and, and the legislature appropriately is very careful before they, they, they take a large step. And I think everybody agrees now we have to deal with that. Legal aid issue, which, which the legislature assisted with a number of years ago, but is still an ongoing problem of, of helping people in civil cases find the, the means and ability to um, uh, get attorneys who can represent them when they can't afford to represent themselves. Um, but some of them, there simply is not enough legal aid money to go around, so a lot of people go to court and represent themselves, what used to be called pro se litigation. And so we've done a lot in the last two years of creating um, forms which can be used by pro se self-represented litigants and dissolution actions um, to try to um, make sure that at least um, um, a simple divorce um, can really get through, that, that really has no complications, is not one that, um, um, is one that they might be able to handle themselves with the forms. But we don't just provide forms, we also provide an educational um, program with those forms that ask people, okay, are there children involved? Are there custody issues? Are there a lot of property issues and so forth? And help people figure out if they really do need an attorney or it is something they can handle themselves. And then we've unbundled legal services so that if they can afford maybe a few hours of an attorney to help them, the attorneys can do that now. They don't have to take them on for the whole case and, uh, and spend thousands of dollars. For a few hundred dollars, someone can really help them um, with the key elements of their case. Um, and those are all things I identified. And a week later, Ronnie White left the court and the nonpartisan plan became a key issue, and that was not something I believe I'd even talked about at that first press conference. So I was not anticipating it to be a large issue. Um, it came on in addition to those other issues which I anticipated and which I think we've addressed. Um, and I think we've addressed that issue uh, well during these two years, too. You did make some changes in the appellate judicial election process mm -hmm. as far as posting meeting times and uh, releasing the applications mm -hmm. of the do yes. Do you think more changes are needed? You know, I, as I said from the beginning, I'm always open to suggestions and changes that will make the process better, and I think these changes have made the process better, and I'm always glad to talk about others, but what I'm not um, willing to talk about is changes that make the plan more political. And it's somewhat frustrating to me sometimes when suggestions are made that the courts have um, been uh, uh, rigid in, in not changing the plan. We have made all those many changes that you that you mentioned, but I will always remain rigid and inflexible on courts need to be impartial. And anything that makes them more political, that doesn't recognize the importance of the distinction between them and the political branches, are not good for Missouri justice. You can give an example. Of, uh, some of the ideas out there are expanding the number of candidates submitted to the governor or giving the governor a chance to reject a candidate. Those things make it more political? Well, the, the proposal that, that most recently was um, before the legislature um, would have done both of those things. It would have been effective um, in uh, January 2013. So with the new governor, um, as it was written, all the lay, they would have expanded from three to five the number of lay commissioners on the uh, commission. So lay members would have been a majority of the commission, and they all would be appointed by the new governor at the same time. Then they would select, um, instead of just uh, three potential finalists, up to 10 potential finalists. 
and submit those names to the governor. And the governor would get to select from those. So the governor would really have majority control at the front end and have um, selection of up to 10 people at the back end. Often, there's only 15 to 20 applicants per position. Um, sometimes we have a large number of very qualified applicants. Sometimes I, I frankly would not find 10 qualified people out of 15 who applied and it really would not be good for the system if uh, the commission were forced to nominate people who they didn't think were up to the job. The system is it set up, make sure that only qualified people get nominated and then the governor can pick whoever they want from that qualified number. One of the complaints has been uh, uh, over the last, especially the last three years, that lawyers have too much control over the process. Uh, the way the appellate commission is set up right now, there's four lawyers, three elected by the bar, and then last two years, you, a chief, the chief justice or somebody from the court. Why isn't that a bad thing? If you got four lawyers out of seven, and isn't that too much weight for? Um, I, I don't think so. Uh, and I don't think there's necessarily a magic system per se, but I think our system has worked incredibly well and I certainly would not want to um, do anything that would upset the balance that's worked so well for Missouri over time. But more importantly, I really question the, um, um, the statement that some people have made wondering if the lawyers should be involved in selecting judges. Whenever you're selecting people for any professional position, you ask other professionals if they're competent at their job. So if you're selecting um, someone to head a college of surgeons, you're going to ask surgeons who's good. You're not going to go ask people who are not familiar with the, with the qualifications and needs of surgery. If you're asking um, any professional board we have um, in Missouri uh, for any kind of field who would be good, um, at that job. You ask people in that field, and in fact, if you look at our statutes and you look at the various boards that do select, that do review, that do regulate any of the professions in Missouri, you see they generally have one lay person and everyone else um, is a member of that professional group. Um, I actually think the input of our lay people is really important on our uh, commission because I think that um, they offer the community viewpoint. Um, they offer uh, judgment as a character of, of the people who are but um, want to become a judge, and that's really important that they have that role. But I think the fundamental purpose of the commission is to find qualified judges, and you're qualified by character and by ability, by legal ability and knowledge. And lawyers are the ones who can really assess that best, because that's essential to your job as a judge.